Today's been a bad day, but I got my lick joy crate, so it's better now. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Steph, and yes, today we are here with an unboxing. I don't know, usually I do my Lit Joy Crate unboxings on the table, but I don't feel like waiting, and I don't feel like cleaning off the table to do that, so yeah, to deal with my face today, I'm sorry. I know it's quite the struggle. I have to deal with it every day. You guys only have to deal with it twice a week. So yeah, today we are unboxing, and I haven't unboxed with my face in frame in so long, so let's just hope this turns This is already turning out badly. We dropped like two of the things. Okay, let's look at what fell out of the bag first. So, this is a box. I can clearly see what this is. What was the theme of the box? Where's the card at? Why did these things fall out first? So this is the Darkness Calls crate. Came with a really cool, try not to look at the inside as I show you this thing. A really awesome card. That is some serious, like, d um, I want to, like, what is the name? Princess and the Frog, you know, the bad guy. I got friends on the other side. Also a Thomas Sanders cover. Have you heard that yet with, like, all the Disney villain mashups? It is so good. I'm pretty sure it's going to be in my top play of 2019 for Spotify. Anywho, back to what these things are. Because it looks like I got myself a pot holder. Woohoo! If only I had some pots to hold. Alright, so it's a small underworld after all. Oh! So we have Hades in the boat down in the underworld with Skeleton driving him. And it's a small underworld after all. That is too cute. I love that. I also love, like, the drawing of Hades. Like, yes, hello. Yes, please. I got friends on the other side. Ooh. We just have a bunch of envelopes. Pick a card. Any card. Oh, there it is. A piece of paper inside. With the same design that is on the, like, little love of the envelope. Wow, is this trying to insinuate that I should throw a party? Because I have no friends. This is a rude lit joy crate. This is extremely rude. Yeah, they all have this little invitation things. So, if this were high school, I might have been able to use these. But this is adult life, and I don't have nearly this many friends. Back to the box. We got our classic squiggies. Love it, love it, love it. And we have another bag. This looks like it may be a pillowcase, which would be very fun. Love me some pillowcases. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's a small pillowcase. Is this from, um, what is that book that everyone, The Cruel Prince? Is this from The Cruel Prince? Is this Cardin? Is that, is that the main character of The Cruel Prince? I haven't read The Cruel Prince. I feel like this is from The Cruel Prince. It's very nice, though. Maybe I should actually read The Cruel Prince. Ooh, what do we got here? Ooh, this is heavy. I don't know who this is. Is this supposed to be Danny from Game of Thrones? Because she dead. Spoilers. Ah! So I think this is a magnet. And I'm not sure who that is supposed to be. I hope my finger wasn't just blocking that the whole time. Um, I'm not sure. It... Oh, there's a green tie. Malfoy? I don't, I don't know who that is supposed to be. Does it stick to metal? Doesn't stick to that metal. Is that even metal? Oh, there's a couple of them. Oh, that was supposed to be Malfoy. Because this is Lucius Malfoy. Yeah. So there's about three of these magnets in here. So we have Mr. Malfoy. We have Draco. And then we have a quote in here that says, My father would hit up here about this. Oh my god, I love it. You know, I don't have enough Southern stuff. I'm a Hufflepuff, but I don't have nearly enough Southern stuff. So that is really cool. I like those. Yeah, I don't know why I was confusing... Well, I can kind of see why I was confusing Draco with Danny, but... My father will hear about this. Looks like we have another pot holder. I got two pot holders. Why were they so separate from each other? They're like two different pot holders with the same pot holder. Still love it. Still awesome. And then we have our cards underneath all the squiggies. Let's see what cards we got in this box. Whoa, hey. There's only two cards in this box. Usually there's three. And I don't know who these characters are. We will get to know them as we get to the card at the end. Oh no! I was trying to show you the back and I failed. That's what the back looks like on both. Alright, we have a dark face. Should I read this before I look at the book? Maybe. Dear reader, welcome to... How do I... Is that a T or an H? You know, we're just going to set this down and open the bag because it's a mystery what is inside. Bum, ba -da -dum. Now it's really a mystery because the dust jacket has also been taken. 
Ooh, you guys get to see it first. What is it? It's upside down. Bop. Ooh. Nocturnia. Oh, I like this dust jacket. This is really pretty. And you know what's really cool? There's gold on this cover, and I just bought gold paint to paint the edges of one of my other books. So maybe I'll include this with that. Because I'm going to try it. A faceless thief, a desperate prince, and a darkness unleashed. I like it. Ooh, there's a map, y'all. I'm living. I love when there's maps inside. And, oh, just like from the card, we have the artwork on the inside of the dust jacket. Mmm, yes, give me them magic vibes. I got hoodoo, I got voodoo, I got things I ain't even try. I got friends on the other side. Oh, I love the magic, the magic vibes coming off that. Oh, heck yes. Let's look at what this book has in store. Ooh, this book has shapeshifters. I am here for it. Not shapeshifter, face shifter, but you know, they're similar, except one's face, one's full body, but you know. Okay, that looks awesome, and ooh, the, ch the book underneath, that gold. Yes! Oh, this is so nice, and ooh, there is artwork on the inside. Wait, or is that the card that comes out? No, that's actually in the book. Oh, and look, it's signed. I forgot, that's always a feature that's signed by the author. Oh, that is so cool. There's an author letter, like, inserted in the book. Usually they don't do that. Usually it's just the card. Oh, that is so freaking cool. Oh my god. I don't think I've ever had a bookish subscription box where it has, like, the letters of the author, like, inserted in the book to where it won't come out. That, I'm tripping out on that. That is so freaking awesome to have that note just in the book. Oh, I love that. So this is... 469 pages to keep me entertained. I think this might be my one of my next reads because I am very interested in it. Sounds awesome. I haven't heard of this young adult book. I haven't heard of this book at all, but already just from like the cover, the stuff inside, and just the description, it sounds awesome and I'm here for it. I seriously can't get over this cover. Now let's take a quick peek at what we got here. I lost my cards already. How did this happen? So this card includes... Characters from Throne of Glass, a book that I have but still have not read. Are you trying to say something, Lit Joy? The Malfoy Men Magnets. These are probably my favorite thing of the whole box because these are so cool. Granted, I may not have recognized Draco at first. I thought he was from Game of Thrones, but we're just going to ignore that. There's been so much Game of Thrones recently with this series just ending. So, but once I saw Lucius, I was like, oh yeah, that's Draco. But, dang it. These are so cool. I especially love that my father will hear, hear about this. I cannot wait to stick these to the locker that I have off screen that I never show you guys. <laughs> All my other bookish magnets is so cool. So these two are in a set. Yeah, so these are a um, hot pad set. And apparently there are nursery rhymes in the book that kind of are very inspired and reminiscent of Greek mythology. So that's why they threw in the little pot holders with Hades in the under underworld. And I love them. And if you hear noises in the background, it's my sister opening the other one. Say hi. What's up? Yo. Ha! It is Cardin! I was right! I may not have read the book, but I know the character because Lil Wolf reads and everyone talks about this book so much. And I always see, like, the incorrect Cruel Prince on my timeline. I should really read that book. Everyone raves about it. And this is the third book coming out later this year or next year. I should just really catch up. Hey, oh my goodness. There is a picture in here for next month's theme, which is the restricted section. And... We all love restricted books. Am I going to be tricked into buying it yet again? This box says me knows me too well. Wait, there was nothing about the little cards in here. Oh, wait, here it is. I just completely read over it. Night Court Stationery. Night Court. Is that... Wait a minute. Yeah, another book I haven't read. And something I'm not sure that I'll ever use because... I don't really have people to write letters to. But they're very pretty. I like the aesthetic. It's time to make some friends, or I'm just going to hit up my one friend and be like, yo, give me your address so I can send you a letter even though we see each other on a, on a pretty often basis. Like, let me have this. And there you guys go. That's all I've got for you guys today. I seriously cannot wait for this book. I still don't know much about it, but it's, it's so pretty. I just, I can't wait. I'm really hyped for this. If you want to see my last unboxings, I'll leave a playlist for you over here. I didn't box them enough. I've gotten one almost every month of this year, whether it be Lit Joy Crate or Owl Crate. Lit Joy holds my heart at the moment because I love them and they've been sending me some really good stuff. I love it. If you want to see my last video, I'll leave it for you right down here. And if you want to subscribe, my face will be right here as well as the button down below. You can hit the bell icon to be notified when I post new videos on Mondays and Fridays. Just in case you want to see some more, it'd be cool if you stuck around. Double thumbs.
that's all I've got for you guys today. I hope you have a lovely day slash night, and I'll see you later. Bye!